I'm Joey, everyone. In today's lesson, I'll teach you the verb want, to want something. It's one of the easiest verbs, in my opinion, and it's really simple. So, if you want to say, I want, you should say, me minda, me minda. You see, it's really simple. There's no difficult letters. It's really simple. So, me minda. You want, shen ginda. He, she, or it wants, mas unda, mas unda. We want, chven gvinda, gvinda. You want, plural form, you, tkven gindat, mat undat, mat undat. So it's really simple and one thing that this is comparing obviously to English. In Georgian, you don't need to say the personal pronoun such as I, for example. So in English, it's necessary to say the pronoun, for example, I want something. But in Georgian, because the verb is different uh, from personal pronoun to personal pronoun, you don't need to say the personal pronoun. You don't need to say the personal pronoun. Okay, like let's go to an example. If I if I say minda, it's already I want, so I don't need to say me minda, because minda is I want and ginda it's you want. We don't need to say shen ginda. Did you understand that? Was that clear? Let's have some examples. If you wanna say I want to rest, I want to rest. You can say me minda das veneba. So, again, what I'm telling you is like the correct form, uh, but again, in Georgian, there is not really much of an order, so you can say Minda das veneba or das veneba minda. It's really, it does not matter. I think there's no order when it's like conversational Georgian, so whenever I want to say something, I Usually, actually, I say it. That's why I never mean that. If you wanna say, I want water, the same thing. Me mean that tzchali, tzchali. Me mean that tzchali. Sorry, I had to put one of these difficult ones because you need to practice. Me mean that tzchali. Or you can simply say, tzchali mean that. It's really simple, the same thing. You can add all the nouns and things that you want to the verbs to the verbs so masunda tsali for example she wants water or he or it now if you want to ask something georgian it's a, a it's all about pronunciation and intonation even so they write something in the same way but they just put the intonation so if you wanna if you if i wanna ask something for example what do you want ra ginda Raginda, please mind the intonation. It's important and it's what differentiates the interrogative with the affirmative and negative. Or if you if you want to say like for example you have water and you wanna ask, you can just say ginda. Tsali ginda, for example. Tsali ginda. Do you want water? Now for the negative form, it's the simplest thing, you just need to put ar before the verb. So, I don't want arminda. Easy as that. Arminda. Also, guys, Georgian has double negative. So, if you want to say, I want nothing, for example, in English, like if you don't, and if you don't want anything, so we would say, Ara peri arminda. I don't want anything. I'm okay. I don't want anything. Ara peri arminda. And the same thing. Arminda, arginda, arunda, argindat, arguinda, arundat. It's the same thing. It's really, really simple. So let's rewind. I want meminda. You want shenginda. He, she, it wants. Masunda. We want Chven Gwinda. The plural form of you, you Kven Gindat. They want Mat Undat. 
I want to rest. Das veneva minda. Me mina das veneba. I want water. Tzhali minda. In the negative form, you just add ar to the verb. Ar minda, ar ginda, arunda, ar guinda, ar gindat, da arundat. And for interrogative, you can just mind the intonation. Ginda, minda. Do I want? Minda, gindat. Do you want? Plural form. So, yeah, this is very simple. Just try to use it say it a lot of times, say I want and describe what you want. And that's it guys, this is it. If you like this lesson, give it a big thumbs up, subscribe our YouTube channel in here, comment below what you want to learn next and what's useful for you, and see you next lesson! Nachmandis!